Yo, what's up guys? Julian here. Just gonna give you a little tour of my room. Um, here's my flat screen. Uh, I just worked, so here are my clothes. My backpack, which I have not touched. Um, Alright, also there's like a light thing in here, so every time I go to bed, I always have to put this thing right here, because it's just, I'm really sensitive when I go to bed. Like, there has to be no light, and it has to be super quiet and stuff. But uh, here's my couch, and I have not cleaned my room, especially like my clothes right here, which I'll somehow get to, um, someday get to. And then here's my dresser. And this is where I usually just record. So I put my iPad right here. And I don't read this Bible. It's a King James Version. So, um, you know, there's different types of Bibles. But this one's like really old, like old, um, I don't want to say old school, but like old, uh, I guess old school. Basically, it's just bigger words and stuff. This is the Bible that I usually read. Um, that's the ESV version. And then here's some food. You never you ne never can go wrong with pizza rolls. Those are the best. And then sweet tea. Oh my gosh, sweet tea is the best. Bomb.com, baby. And then some other things. But, um, yeah, that's just my room real fast. And All right. Yeah, there's Judson. I want to go Judson, but, you know, it's too much money. So I want to be going to Harper. So I'm excited for that. But here we go. All right. You can stay. All right. So sorry for uh, showing you my room if you liked it or not. But anyways, I want to talk to you guys about satisfaction. So I've been really um, thinking about um, satisfaction and stuff and like what satisfies us. So um, I'm gonna talk about what satisfies us and then you know what satis what I'm not saying you should. It's I'm not because I don't want to say like if you. Oh, all right, I'll get to it. Okay, sorry, sorry. sorry. So I'm just going to talk about real fast what satisfies us, like the, um, what we think satisfies us the most. So I'll talk about myself and I'll talk about other people. So with me, um, you know, it can be like pride. It can be uh, like popularity, trying to think like that's what satisfies me the most. Um, you know, maybe a girlfriend, like why I have a girlfriend, I think that's going to satisfy me so much. Uh, just like these little things that I think is going to satisfy me. It might do it for a little bit, but it just doesn't satisfy me completely. Like there's still a gap of me feeling, you know having a weird feeling inside myself, um, of not being satisfied, uh, and then for, like, I mean, other people, I'm assuming it's got to be, like, you know, the same thing, if, if, you, if you're a girl, especially, like, the way your body looks, you know, just body image, and, um, and stuff like that, so there's a lot of things, uh, maybe, like, drinking as well, just, like, for anybody, like, drinking, smoking, there's a lot of things that, you know, that we try to satisfy ourselves with, but it just doesn't satisfy us, so we always have, like, this, um, you know, this, well, I personally do, like, I always have, like, um, I just feel empty after I do something, like, whether it's, um, you know, bashing on my friend, or whether it's, you know, trying to do something which I can, or whether it's, you know, having a lot of pride in something that I do, or, you know, um, I'm not gonna lie, I, I, I watched pornography, pornography before, so whether it's doing that, um, and then afterwards, you know, having a weird, empty feeling inside of yourself, it's just, it doesn't, it's not good, and, you know, it's just, you know, we try to satisfy, we try to, like, satisfy ourselves with that because we try to, like, um, fill in a gap, which we can't do on our, by ourselves. So, that's just, you know, what other people, I think, do, and what myself, I, what I usually do sometimes. So, um, that's that. But then, see, this is where it gets tricky, because I don't want to say you have to, like, accept Christ and believe in God to, like, you're going to get satisfied. Like, I personally believe that, but I don't want you guys to think that I'm making you guys do that. So I'm just going to speak on myself. So basically, um, you know, I accepted Christ, like, two years ago. Um, and, you know, he satisfied me the most. Um, sometimes I might not feel satisfied just because, you know, we live in sin. And this is just a sinful world. So we're never going to feel 100% satisfied with, uh, within ourselves. But once um, we accept Christ, you know, you're going to feel more and more and more satisfied. Um, like I said, you can't feel 100% satisfied just because it's, like, a sinful world and stuff. Um, but that doesn't mean, um, God isn't 100% satis you know, satisfaction and stuff. That makes sense. I don't know if that does. But basically, you know, God is, and He's perfect and stuff. So, if you put your eyes on Him, if you keep your eye on the prize, that's what I've been trying to tell myself a lot, um, you're going to feel satisfied, you know. You're still going to go through some, like, ups and downs and sin but on the way there. But, um, you know, your identity is in Christ. It's not in, like, drinking. It's not in girls. It's not in guys. It's not in sex. It's not in smoking. It's not in popularity. It's not in all these other things, but it's in God. I'm not saying you're not going to, like, make mistakes, still, but you know where your ultimate satisfaction is, and that's, you know, I know where it is, and that's in God. So, um, like I said, I mean, it's up to you guys if you want to take the next step in accepting Christ. 
Like, that's a big step. Um, but uh, if you have any questions, you can just talk to me about that, and that'd be pretty cool. Um, so I just want to make this video real fast because there's a lot of things that tries that we try to like satisfy ourselves with um, that I've noticed nowadays and stuff. So I hope you guys get something out of it, and um, hope you guys are still enjoying your spring break. Um, just have a couple more days left. But besides that, that is all. So I hope you guys have a great day. Bye. -bye.